see, this actually has my face on it. Hello. It's showtime. All right, hello everybody. So, this is once again The Witch Fights Back, and today I actually want to show you a whole bunch of masks that I got from Lenar Bazaar, because I'm a little obsessed with these designs. <laughs> like, let me show you. Here's one of them. You have these nice little Japanese dragon designs and these beautiful floral details as well. The orange really pops. So if you're wearing something dark and spooky, or, you know, if you're wearing something orange too, that also pops out. I just wanted to show. Yeah, I'm kind of, <laughs> kind of doing a little mask try on slash a mask show off for you guys. Because, you know, mask up. This one I'm also super obsessed with because, you know, reminds me of Disturbed. So, <laughs> this is definitely one of my favorites. It's a nice kick-ass design. And also, if you feel like some of these masks are a little too feminine for you, well, we have masks that can also fit the male as well or the more masculine types too. So, this is just that mask. And these are all super breathable, by the way. Like... I don't know how to describe it. They're nice, and even though they're a little thin, like these little masks are something that you can easily clean and wear all the time and wear over again. And some of these masks, like this one, has a little pull thing, so you can go ahead and make the little ears as, you know, as tight or as loose as you want them. I actually have small ears, so some of these would be big on me if it didn't have these little things. So, that is that. And it's also a nice stretchy material, too. Just saying. Like this mask, it just has the little stretchy bands, and it's a nice size. It feels nice and comfortable, too. It's not like the dollar store mask or anything that has, like, the awkward hardness that is right here. I don't know. Like, some masks are have their materials a little rough, you know, around the ears. But, here's another one of my favorites. And this one has beautiful skull and floral design, which I know I'm going to be wearing this a lot. <laughs> just saying. And it just looks so cool. I love these masks so much. And since they are super breathable, yeah, you can kind of see my mouth moving a little bit. But it's kind of fun. Aww. <laughs> Anyway, on to the next one. Ooh, so for all you little witchy types, there are some awesome masks that do have a really cool witch aesthetic to it. Like this one, I love it because obviously I got a thing for the moon. Because <laughs> the, you know, my goddess is the moon. So when it comes to anything with the moon design, I freak out over it. I love this mask so much. It's another one of my favorite. I, I have more than a few favorite masks, which is why, you know, I wanted to show these off. But I'm, I'm going to save the one that I believe I'm probably going to wear more, more than ever for the very last, just because. All right, next one. There is this beautiful little design with this butterfly. Oh, and it has a nice little rose right there. It's kind of a little cheeky. Try to be upright and have the flower right there. I kind of like having the flower on my chin. But you know, it all depends on you. This is probably the proper way to wear it. But yeah, it's just no matter what, these designs are just gorgeous. And they're so vibrant and they really pop up. I'm going to have photos of these masks um, on me because I actually did a photo shoot today. But, for now, I just want to do a little sneak peek video to show you guys, you know, what you can buy and what you might be missing. Because <laughs> seriously, some of these masks, missing them in my life. The next mask up is another floral design, like this. Again, really comfortable, and all of these are really comfortable and easy to breathe in. I'm just not even going to say that because really they're pretty much made out of the same material, the same cottony type material, but it's very smooth too. I don't know. I just love it so much. I don't know what kind of material this is, but it's great. It's great. All right. 
For those of you that like a little lighter feminine touches, there are some of these musts that look like little teacup type of a print. Something you would see on a porcelain dish. Maybe something to make you look like a little porcelain doll. However you want to complete your look, you'll find a mask that fits you. <laughs> Another floral design. Yeah, lots of florals, but they're pretty, okay? They are just beautiful, so beautiful. And kind of goes along with my makeup. So that's cool. Aha! <laughs> I have way too much fun with it. <laughs> oh, we are going to see. Despite, um, this is a really cool mask. And also, nice and Halloween y, too. Like, if you feel like you want to get some masks that are more Halloween ish, you know, obviously, they can hook you up. And this one is a little bit more wide, letting you have. A little bit of space right here. I don't know if you guys care for that or not, or if people would rather have it all up so that then they can like not do any makeup at all right here. But you know, it's a thing. <laughs> How many of you guys aren't like doing any makeup down here? Because let's be honest, <laughs> if you have to work or something for many hours a day, it's it's not like you know, a have to put makeup on half of your face. This is another gorgeous design that I love because this kind of reminds me of, I mean, I know that it has the little Greek design around here, the, I'm forgetting the name of this little design, but it has the little Greek squares around here and beautiful little feathers that kind of look like Native American. So it's a little bit of like Greek with a little bit of Native American, but I don't, I just love it. I think it's beautiful. It's so beautiful to me. Ooh, so this is a fun one. This is a more tie-dye type of a thing, and I do have a lot of purple stuff that does not look good. <laughs> but yeah, this one is a little bit bigger. Like, there is a lot of space, but you know, again, it is stretch and all that. I I think I have a small face. People have told me that I have a small face, and I think that that's just being confirmed with these masks. But it's so cute. Kind of reminds me of ink and water, having different ink colors or paint and water. Next up, another gorgeous design. You got some more butterflies over here. This is more of a like gothy butterfly design. But yeah, you got some butterflies. You have this beautiful rose. And then you have this beautiful color contrast. And some animal print too. It's, it's just cool. I love all the detail work in these masks. They're well worth it. Okay, this mask obviously is so fucking me. Like, if you know me at all, you you know that this mask is me. Oh, this is one that I definitely have to tighten up because I have teeny little ears. Do, 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 do. But, yeah, if you're just as obsessed with vampires as I am, this mask is fun. Hey, now no one will ever tell you to smile, because... Smile. Has anyone seen Terrifier? This... <laughs> uh, I don't know, but... Man, ah. Might be meant for people with bigger noses. Because the mouth isn't sitting where my mouth does. Ooh, baby, you got a big mouth. It's a big old thing. These masks, the one that's like this and the spider one, they're pretty much the easiest mask to breathe out of, I think. I think they're made of, like, even a thinner material than the other masks are. But they're so cute. They're so cute. 
I'm just having a lot of fun with the fake face, you know? Okay. <laughs> All right, next up is this awesome Ouija board mask. And I have been kind of obsessed with Ouija stuff recently. Like, I have more than a few items that have Ouija board stuff on it all, all over. So, you know, this is also a really cool mask for me. I just can't pass it up. Not at all. Totally worth it. For my favorite mask. Six feet back, motherfucker. Six feet back, motherfucker. I love it. The best social distancing mask. Stay six feet back from me. And it is great. Like seriously, not only does it accommodate for my sailor mouth, always saying motherfucker and everything, but this is great. Someone is going way too close to you in the line. Just turn and face them and just be like... I just like this shit too much. But, alright. So that is all of my masks that I have gotten from Lenore Bazaar. I'll go ahead and link them down below. Because, honestly, yeah. The, I can't. There is just way too many of these cute masks. I, I couldn't help but show them off. I needed to show them off to you guys, okay? Even if I'm sitting in my ugly chair while I'm showing these off to you guys. Oh, well. Have a good day, stay safe out there, and until we meet again, bye-bye my lovelies.